family. Each and every one of us have a very strong personality, which makes it sometimes very difficult because we are fighting. But the love of each other is bigger than that. So we will fight and we will do a lot of things. But at the end, we are still family looking after each other. Religion for our family is like a foundational baseline because we're very part of the church. My dad still runs the church band. She did guitar singing. I sang as well and played drums and he still plays the bass guitar and everything. So very involved. My mother actually does the sound like so it's like the whole band is sitting right here type of thing. We tend to be putting uh, big decisions on the table, talk about it and try to get consensus. But each one is their own person. They're doing their own stuff, taking their own decisions. And we try to also brought up our kids independently, that they take responsibility, take their own decisions. We're married and still at living at home and they're married and she's actually old enough to like live on her own, but Corona. So we're all staying at home and just like you know, figuring it out. I have a, a credit card that is only for shopping for the house. The two daughters and the son-in-law, they contribute to the grocery shopping. I would like to see them when they leave home uh, permanently that they will, will be financially secured. In our generation, it was normal to get married between 24, 25. They got married a bit earlier because they are working already and they get their financial independence and everything. Same sex marriage for me, it's do what you need to do, be happy, it doesn't matter. We do the Christmas thing, we do um, Easter. We don't have other um, cultural things that we do. Our great grandfathers, all these dances that we were actually taught at school, but we don't do it anymore. It's not cool. <laughs> My mother and my father passed away on 74. They were still quite healthy, my mother, my, my father not so, but they were still living in a smaller, downsized home on their own, and they didn't get to that age that they needed some help. We are lucky as Blaus that our family that is still left is all living in Wolfish Bay, that is about 400 kilometers from here, so we can easily uh, go there and, and also visit them. Uh, we are Afrikaans, as you can hear. Uh, we sp speak English as a second language, which we call Namlish. It's our own version of the English language. Um, we spell color with a U and favorite with a U. <laughs>